Well, hi, Hillbrook students. Next week is Everyone Can Code. There are going to be 12 different stations going on as part of a worldwide hour of code. You'll get to go to two stations. Let me explain what your choices are, and then you are going to give us your top three choices. The first one is Sphero Art. With this, you are going to create your own piece of abstract art using a Sphero robot. You're going to use code to tell the Sphero where to go. Next choice is Minecraft Designer. With this, you need to actually build the world of Minecraft in code. Super cool. Up next is paper coding. So you're going to be using paper, no computers, and you're going to be programming your friends, telling them how to stack cups, um, things like that. Up next is little bits. With these, these are magnetic pieces of computer that you're going to stick together to make something. Might be a musical instrument, might be a car that can move. After that, you're going to be using Scratch, which can build games. You're going to be using it to animate your own name and make a movie. Up next, the Hillbrook Air Corps. You're going to be coding the drones to fly through hula hoops and land on targets. Next, we have Dash and Dot. You're going to turn them into actors, and you're going to make your own movie. And the only way you get to control Dash and Dot is through code. You're going to build your own computer using Piper. Piper is a Raspberry Pi, and they teach you how to build the computer using Minecraft. Osmo takes things in the real world and shows them on your iPad. You can learn how to code, you can make pizzas, whatever you have in front of your iPad also shows up on the Osmo. Up next, we have the Ozobot. You actually don't need to use a computer or an iPad for these. You use colors and markers and lines to code the Ozobots and tell them where to go, how to turn, and how fast to move. We're going to use Spheros again in the Sphero maze, where you're going to build a custom maze and then try and code your Sphero through the maze. And your final choice is the Makey Minky, where you take real-world objects and map them onto an object in Sphero so that when you hit something like a banana, it makes the sound of a conga. So those are your choices this year for Hour of Code. Please give us your top three choices, and we look forward to having Everyone Can Code on Monday.